Today, we have to go to where our battalion is. They're in Kleber. We're gonna head out to Kleber this morning. I'll show you along the Autobahn. Bomb holder to Kleber is probably 35, 45 minute drive. Come along with us. Fire extinguisher just went off. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. The whole back seat. Oh, you haven't seen it yet. Oh <laughs> That's why we were choking. Oh We got some army stuff to take care of, so uh, see you soon. We just drove to the wrong place. Uh, now we gotta get back on the road and drive probably another hour to where we're supposed to be. So, bye. We made a stop at uh, Ramstein Air Base. We're gonna stop and get some food. We're getting Charlie's. Little guys, chicken teriyaki. Clean vehicle from the explosion. <laughs> Headed back to the barracks. We just got back from uh, Klaver and then we had to go to Simbach, then Ramstein for lunch. Very, very eventful day. <laughs> Ten minutes into the trip, you saw it. There was a fire extinguisher that blew up in the back of the van. That was crazy. Couldn't breathe. Had to pull over on the Autobahn. Got it, you know, secured and then went about our, about our merry way. On the way back here, we made a wrong turn and we almost went through we we're on our way to france <laughs> good morning yesterday was a lot of fun we had a pretty good time went for a boat cruise down the rhine river we saw a bunch of castles uh, from the bank we saw a bunch of uh, small little villages or towns we stopped at one town um, i don't remember the name of it we got off there and then we walked around this little this little uh, strip there was a bunch of shopping um, then we stopped and had food at this little restaurant I had spetzel. I had the Zebel schnitzel. Piece of pork with sauteed um, or grilled onions, sauteed onions. Schnitzel came with these little, I thought when it came out, I thought they were like uh, cheese sticks. <laughs> but they were uh, little potatoes, you know, deep fried potatoes, which were really good. We got done eating and then we walked down the strip a little bit and there was a um, little ice cream place. I didn't video it because uh, I didn't want Ash to get upset that I was over here just, you know, on a vacation, basically. So I didn't have an ice cream and whatever. So uh, it was really good. It was really good. We toured that little strip for a couple hours. And then we got on the bus. And then the bus took us to another town that had a wall around it. And then from there, we found this tower. So we climbed up into the tower, got some video and some footage from there and then we looked up on top of the hill and we saw this castle so then we uh, decided to walk up the trail that was an interesting hike so we're walking up the trail and there's a sign and it says there's two arrows pointing this way and then this way and there's two German words we didn't even, we should have looked it up in Google Translate but I guess one was hard one was easy or shortcut maybe I don't know but the hill was straight up like this and there was uh, some stakes in the ground with some wire rope that you're supposed to just like pull yourself up with. So we did that, got up to the top, got up to the castle. It turns out that place is a hotel. They turned it into a hotel. It's like, oh, okay, so we're looking around, you know, uh, 
Um, they have like a little small little gift shop in there. And, and then we looked at the bell tower. We're like, hey, let's go up in the bell tower. So we climb up, up in there, um, went all the way up and there's like, you go up and there's a little floor, right? So there's, a, there's rooms, they're actually hotel rooms. Um, and so we climbed all the way up to the very top and then there was a sign, it was like, this area is for guests only. So I'm like, we're not guests, so we left. And then on the way out, we weren't even supposed to climb up in those rooms or those uh, the bell tower because it's for guests only. So, oops. Um, but then we started thinking, like, there's no elevator. So, like, say you get all the way to the car, or, like, you get out of the car, you go to you go check in, get all your bags, you get up to, like, the fifth floor or whatever, however, whatever the top floor where your room is, and then... Uh, your key doesn't work, or you forgot something out of the car, or whatever. You had to go all the way back. Uh, I don't know. Seemed kind of a headache. But you were staying in a castle, so it was, it was pretty cool. Uh, so we toured that little area for that little village. So we came out of there, went down into the strip, and like it's all like cobblestone roads, and you can tell it's, it's a very, very old historic town. So then uh, we're walking along, and then we ducked inside this little uh, restaurant. We all got one beer. We had I forgot the name of it. It was a Pilsner. It was really good. Oh, I guess any beer's good. So the trip was actually through the MWR here. MWR is Morale, Welfare, and Recreation. They're trying to put on a, at least a trip a month for uh, for soldiers to get out and explore the, the village and whatever. So it cost us $69. That was for the, the boat ride. Transportation from the base to the boat ride. Dropped us off to the first town. The bus came and picked us up. Took us to the second town and then brought us back to the base. It was really nice just to get out and see like the German culture and like, you know, have some of the food and stuff like that. I will definitely be doing something like that again later on. Today, I gotta do some laundry. I have to clean up start packing, we're going on a trip. We're going to Lithuania. There's a, a certain town we're going to. We actually have some army stuff to do, but they don't want us wearing army uniforms. So we're gonna be wearing civilian clothes, which is kind of cool. But yeah, I'm just gonna hang out today. Uh, it's kind of cloudy and dreary outside. All right, one of my, <laughs> one of my uh, favorite TV shows to watch, like when I'm by myself, is uh, Archer. I think it's hilarious. I know Ash can't stand it. There's a lot of adult jokes in there, so. So yeah, I'm uh, gotta do some laundry first. Anyway, talk to you later.